Hey all, it's been a while since I ever did a FFT Arena match. Um, I'm going to do something a little bit different. I'll be showcasing three of my teams, actually, since I rarely ever show showcase my own teams. But hey, it's whatever. Um, my team first on top is Let the Mime Have Her Fun. First is one of the teams uh, that Reno requested for him to face. He wanted to face one of my teams with his So You Think You Can Dance. Alright, so, I'll explain my team in a minute. I have Geomancy Fun, the Geomancer. Mime Fun, the Mime. Laura Fun, the Scholar. And Saint Fun, the Bard. Basically, everyone here uh, is all MA-based. I got uh, Magic Song here. Uh, Focus here, the Mime can Mimic. And Scholar using Bio and Bio 3. As well as Raise and Asuna. The mime also has item, but because, due to the glitch of uh, mine for the item, she can actually throw the item. So, yay. <clears throat> I have 108 gems on both my Geomancer and my mime, so that when we do the uh, Geomancy that actually has an elemental boosting, uh, 108 gems can compound that, which compound that, which is really cool. And the mime can just mimic that, which is also really cool. They both got kind of flood for Geomancy fun. And the Scholar can use a uh, short charge... Bio Bio 3, and again, the Mime can Mimic, and with Magic Attack up, the Mimic can actually hurt quite a bit. And this is my uh, Heaviest Hitter Draw Bard. Yeah, with uh, Overwhelmed Cheery. Can't have three units of Magic Attack up, obviously, but I can compromise, obviously. Uh, yeah, simple plan. Just boost the MA and damage, damage, damage. That's the goal here. For Reno, we got Waltz the Mime, Hip Hopper the Monk, Jazz Dance the Monk, and Ballet Dancer the Chemist. So, this is a team that uh, likes to chip away with Wiznizbis, as the two monks here both have Wiznizbis, and the Mime can mimic the Wiznizbis as well. Uh, the Mime also has Talk Skill, mainly Blackmail Mimic Derivon. Of course, pretty tanky with the um, choice of items, of course. On yielding as well to make him really tanky. The monks are super physical, super anti physical, with defense up 40 brave and church. So, physical hits are gonna be a no no on these girls because they can just shrug it off. PA save is there for increased chakra healing. They both also got secret fist, so they're not just tanks, they can also inflict death sentence. The mime can do that as well. And the chemist here, item bot, but also has union magic in forms of zombie and petrify. That's pretty much it. Um, don't know how the match will go, but hey, but hey, it's all about having fun, right? We're gonna be going to map A9, Poeskas Lake. <coughs> it has been a while since we've seen one of Reno's teams, and this is my actual second time showing off my one of my mime teams. I'm normally n never known to make mime teams because I just don't really have the time to make up one, but I'll see what I can do here. Yeah, the uh, poison's gonna definitely linger as well. Counterflow, ooh, stop proc, nice. And here's the mimic magic song. And now the mime's gonna waltz forward and go for a blackmail, which doesn't hit. The mime can hit, my mime can heal herself with the X potion. Poison is still lingering though. Look, Quake, doing good damage, actually. The body to go for Cheery. And wow, just dropped one of the monks already. There's a Holy. 
and oh yeah oh mind holy yes ah but too bad i got blocked damn you wizard mantle that would have been amazing if there was a mind holy and it actually connected that last was not to be though oh no meat bone slash damn you rng that would have been amazing that would have been absolutely incredible if there was a meatbone slash. Oh! Mine backfire. Whoops. <laughs> well, at least, at least my Geomancer has heal to get rid of the poison, which is very good. And Chewy, wow, double kill. And my skull goes down. That's unfortunate, but... Oh, the mine does not. Oh yeah, because X potion. Because Phoenix down, that would have been like a wasted turn. No matter though. As I take round one, we shall see what happens in round two. Okay, so round two is about to begin. We are now in map eighty-two, Bed Desert. Uh, last match, um, there, there was some mime shenanigans on both sides, definitely. Uh, more so from my team. I wished the Mime Holy would have connected, but it was not to be, unfortunately. Uh, now we're going to see a Holy from... Oh, we're going to see a Bio, actually. There's a Holy. Actually does hit the Mime. There's two poison procs now from Reno. Gunshot from the um, chemist. Magiston hitting a bunch of my teammates, which is good. Because now the damage output is going to be even higher for Reno the handle. X potion from my mime. Keeping that bar nice and healthy. Kamatachi. Good damage all around. No uh, Mimic Kamatachi because the mime is a little bit too close. So I'd whack for my bar. Probably didn't want to injure the mime. And down goes the monk. Or one of Reno's monks. Now the Wizard Knives spam should be cut in half. Chemist is still out of range for a resurrection. Only a punch from the mime. And X Potion to heal my Scholar. And more Kamatachi. PA save. That's going to increase the damage done with, with Nisbis. Bees and Boat. Perfect. Now the monk can't now the monk can't use with Nisbis anymore. Bio 3. All she can do is just bag one. No meat bone slash. That's and that's fair because the bard is out of position for a meat bone slash. Plus the vertical tolerance also can be a factor as well. Kamatachi serve for anti sandbag purposes, of course. No mind elemental again. She's a little bit too far away. Oh, a little bit too close, I should say. No draw out, huh? Not sure why the bard didn't go for draw out. Down goes the chemist. And now the monks could probably try to pull off another Wiz Nisbis. Now everyone on my team is poisoned. So that could be a bit of a lingering annoyance. Free raise triggers. The Geomancer goes for a heal. So half my team is no longer poisoned. And here's a Murasame. A 240 Murasame heal. Double kill from Bio. 
Oh boy. See, what can Waltz do? Mimic Derivon. Catches no one. That's unfortunate for Reno. I guess when Nysmith can use to chip away. Again, more Murasami healing. Now the mime's undead, thanks to Bio 3. I pretty much got this match in the palm of my hand. It's really only a matter of time. Mimic Derivon, Mimic Derivon, excuse me, only puts the Geomancer to sleep. And woohoo! Auto Potion Kill! That was nice. And the bard's gonna do magic song because he got nothing better to do. And this sh should be it relatively very soon. And the mime didn't mimic ma magic song that time. That's a bit weird, but. No matter, I guess, because this match is pretty much over. Alright, Reno. Uh, that was your... Uh, so you think you can dance team? It pretty much showed that it can't stand up to draw and geomancy. Uh, GG.